Well, hello and welcome back to our channel. My name is Maria. And I'm Leilani. And this is While, While Drinking, Drinking Wine. Wine. Cheers. Cheers. That's a little different, huh? Hmm. But it's good. Hmm. <laughs> so what we're drinking today, and then we'll get into these little cute little things. Um, what we're drinking today is from Wilson Creek. That's why we have the Wilson Creek glasses there. This is a Roussan from Temecula Valley. It's a 2020. So something that we haven't even had before, but of course Leilani is a Wine Club member and so she brought this over today for us to try. Yeah, and it's different. Mm -hmm. It's different than the Pinot Grigio. Yeah. I lo also love uh, Wilson Creek's Viognier, but they mm -hmm. are now finally making new batches that are going to be available, I think, in the next coming weeks. So. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So it's not bad. It's not bad no. at all. There's a, a little bit of a aftertaste, but it's a good aftertaste, not a bad aftertaste. Yeah. It's dry, right? It's, it's a dry. There's it's a drier, yeah, yeah, but you can really taste the fruit. You can yeah. really, really taste the grapes in here, but it's a very, it's not sweet at all, so no. pretty good. So you'll notice that we have these little wine charms on here. So where did we get these? So if you guys have been watching our videos for a few weeks now, we went to the Food and Wine Festival at California Adventure, and we purchased these there. So yeah. we haven't used them yet. And I, so I told Maria, I said, where's our wine charms? We need yep. to use these. We so need to use them. So, so they're, use them today. <laughs> they're really, really cute. They light up and everything. They even blink, but we thought for the video, we're they not do. gonna blink they them. Blink. <laughs> <laughs> we're not gonna blink them. So. so let everybody know what we're doing today because everybody can tell we're wearing red, white, and blue today. My new hat, I just got this. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah. So we have been inspired by a picture, which I'll show you right here. This picture inspired us uh, to do a wine cork American flag for 4th of July because 4th of July is a week away. Mm -hmm. And so we wanna celebrate with uh, a craft for 4th of July. So yeah. we, we haven't done a craft in a while. So we I thought, mm -hmm. let's, let's try to do something. So we're gonna do it two different ways. I'm mm -hmm. gonna do it one way. I'm gonna paint mine like in the picture. So I'm using the picture and that's exactly how I'm gonna do it. Mm -hmm. Maria's gonna go a little bit different. She's gonna use food coloring. Food coloring, so mine's gonna be more of a, like Americana. So the faded, almost like faded glory. And so that's what I'm going to do. And we'll see how it works out because we've never attempted this. But everything we're using besides the corks, because the corks are basically free in the bottles of wine, right, uh, is from Dollar Tree. So everything we use is gonna be a Dollar Tree product. So there you go. All right, I'm ready to go. Okay, here Let, we go. Let's go. Okay, so here we are at our crafting table, if you will. This is the dining table, but we use it as our crafting table. So I just wanted to show you um, the the items that we're going to be using from the Dollar Tree. So Maria, you want to talk about the, this little cork sheet that you got and how so, we're going to use that? Yeah, so the cork sheet, um, I, I bought these at the Dollar Tree some quite some time to uh, go and so they are adhesive cork sheets so what we're going to do is instead of using this side we're going to turn it over where it is adhesive and we are going to actually put these on here but yet we're also going to use uh, glue so glue sticks as well um, to actually glue everything together so that it sticks a lot better yeah. we've got different colors of paint here so we've got our red paint we've got our white paint and then I've got a little thing of blue paint because we don't need as much. So, so that'll be good for Leilani's. And what I'm going to do is I got these food colorings at the Dollar Tree. So I will be using the red and the blue of these. So not a lot of supplies needed for this, um, this craft and we'll see what happens. Well, that was fun. It was, I enjoyed <laughs> that. We haven't done a craft in so long, even though mine looks like a child did it, you know, yeah. so. <laughs> I paint all over my hands. <laughs> mine did, mine does too. Yeah, but again, like I was saying, mine is Faded Glory and Leilani did hers, just so similar to what our inspiration project was. So, yeah. yeah. So, you wanna show them? Yes. Okay. 
here we go. Here we go. So, <laughs> look at my stars. Yeah. Kindergarten work. <laughs> they could probably do better than yeah, me. <laughs> look at my stars. They're just kind of like whatever. But <laughs> but yeah, this is Faded Glory. So it looks pretty good on camera. Not in person, but it looks pretty good on camera. So I'll be using this as a trivet for 4th of July. So yeah, I think they turned out really cute. I really enjoyed doing it. Mine's these. a Fetzer flag. Yeah, well, mine is too, but mine is all different things. So yeah, it's a really fun. Hashtag Fetzer flag. Yep. <laughs> and again, mine was done with food coloring. So mm -hmm. I did have the... Um, the, the blue and the red food coloring. So you can see that it kind of turned out burgundy and a dark blue. And then I just used a little bit of white paint to make those, um, to make the, uh, I look at this, I've got all the no. <laughs> I was just to, to make that. To make the stars a little bit too. Yay, mm -hmm. They're cute yeah. though, I really like them. Yeah, I think they turned out really, really I'll well. I'll put this on my mantle so mm -hmm. I can celebrate wine and, and American, Americana. Uh, Americana, <laughs> that's right, that's right, yeah. So yeah. let everybody know what we're drinking again today. So we are drinking this Wilson Creek Roussanne. Roussanne? Roussanne. How do you say it? Roussanne. Roussanne. <laughs> it's a yeah. 2019. Mm -hmm. Once again, from our backyard in Temecula. Yep. Um, it is a, no, it's not a 2019, it's a 2020. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's a 2020. It's a 2019. Yeah. But it is a mm -hmm. 2020 mm -hmm. Roussanne from mm -hmm. Wilson Creek. Right. Right. So it's very enjoyable. Um, I wanted to try something a little bit different. We always do Pinot Grigio. We've been doing a lot of rosé all day. So Maria was asking me, what do you want to drink? And I told her I had something perfect for us. If you like these type of videos, please consider subscribing to our channel and hit that little bell button to be notified every single time that we upload and give us a thumbs up because when you do that, it does tell the, us that you do like the content that we're providing. And check us out where? On Instagram at while underbar drinking underbar wine. That's right. And with that, until next time. Until next time. Cheers. Cheers. over the past couple weeks we really do appreciate you and each and every one of our subscribers yes. and give us a thumbs up when when you give <laughs> start over yeah. and give us a thumbs up and give us a thumbs up <laughs> <laughs> i say that today you, are, you always have a hard time saying thumbs up I know. okay oh okay and give us uh, oh, why can't i say it today should i say it <laughs> And give us a thumbs up because when you do that, it tells us that you really do enjoy. <laughs> okay, I'll, I'll do different. I'll do it different. Okay. okay. Hold on. Because <laughs> I can see you struggling to say it. Okay. And hit that little bell button. <laughs> Why are we have to thumbs up though? No, you have the bell button first and oh. then. And give us a, a thumbs up. <laughs> I can't, I can't do it today. <laughs> I haven't even drank. This is all I've drank so far. She hasn't even had any. Okay. <laughs> <laughs>